Hi, T-Burns. This is Mr. T. Hey! And I'm here on my farm. Uh, I'm making a show for you. I hope they have it every day. It's called On the Farm with Mr. T. And we're going to do some uh, reinforcement and enrichment activities for your education. But really, we're just going to be having some fun. And we're going to do some of the same routines that we did at school so you can kind of feel like it's a little like a little bit like being back at school. So first, let's go ahead and do this. Let's get uh, in a power pose with your fists on your hips, chest out, and let's take some deep breaths <sighs> to be calm and in control, <sighs> to make good choices, <sighs> to help us think of others. And one more deep breath. Let's go to work. Okay. First off today, we're going to give some shout outs. I have uh, some parents that got back to me that tell me that their T-Birds were working hard at home. Uh, Amelia has been working with her mom on reading. Great job. Julie's mom told me she's working on reading and her adding and subtracting facts. Awesome. David's mom showed me that a picture of him reading the book, The List. So I know he's working up to be a triple diamond reader someday. Ava's mom sent me a photo and information about Ava. She's working on a first grade book. Way to go, Ava. And she's been helping at home and working hard and playing hard. Uh, Skya's mom wrote to me and said that she's working on her words and doing adding and subtracting. Awesome. Way to go. You guys are rocking it. So um, if you want to shout out on the next show, this is On the Farm with Mr. T, episode one. If you want to shout out on episode two, have your mom and dad shoot me an email, have a picture of what you're doing at home, how you're learning about things, how you're helping at home, how you're being a leader. Okay. Um, first, we're going to have a dictation. Just like back at school. Can you believe it? Dictation. So put the uh, video on pause. Go get a pencil, a crayon, a marker, some paper, whatever you need. So go get it. Put it on pause now. Okay. Did you go get it? Okay, great. So now let's do a dictation. And the words we're going to have today, uh, the first word is net. Go ahead and tap it out. Write it down. Net. Like I shot the ball in the hoop and it went through the net. The next word is mad. Mad. If you can't get along with your brothers and sisters, don't be mad. Use stop, walk, talk. Good job. The next word is best. Like school is the best, but on the farm with Mr. T, episode one is almost the best. Best. Now a memory word, the, the T-birds are cool, the. Another word is frog, the frog jumped off the log, frog. And another memory word is of, I have lots of friends. And dictation is never complete without the bonus word. Your bonus word is fantastic. It was a fantastic day out today. Fantastic. Great. If you need to hear those words again, here they are. Going across the top. Net. Mad. Best. The. Frog. And of. Okay. If you need to pause and get them all down, do that now. Because you're about to see the answers. Are you ready? Okay, this part is what I call sidewalk chalk dictation. Now, um, hang with me here. This Hopefully this will work. So we're, now we're outside my farm. There is my farm. There's uh, some fruit trees we've been pruning. Um, some of the beds, cover crop growing there. A big wheelbarrow of mulch and raspberries and blackberry canes down below. And right here is our dictation so you should have had n at net m ad mad b est best the memory word the frog f -r -og, frog another memory word i can't sound it out just gotta say it of and your bonus word is and fantastic fantastic
Wow, awesome. I hope you got all those right. If you did, give yourself a good pat on the back and say congratulations. All right, good job on that. Uh, so that's our dictation for today. Now we have something I'm going to call carrot math. Now, this might be a little bit of a challenge. You know how good my carrots are from the farm, right? You've all had them. They taste fantastic. Mrs. T and I are going to make some carrot burgers. Can you believe it? They're going to be so good. But I have to take some carrots in from the barn. So right here I have in the bag a mystery amount of carrots. I don't know how many. You don't know how many. But I'm going to pull out some to take to the house so we can start cooking them. Hey, yo, this is a crazy looking guy. That guy's going in. One. Here goes another carrot in. Two. And finally, this guy right here. Three carrots. I am taking three carrots into the house to make carrot burgers. In this bag, I still have left. I have four left. I have three going in the house, four left in the bag. Your question, how many were in the bag all together before I started taking them out? So your job is to figure out how many carrots were in the bag, write a number equation to go with it to show that three carrots went in the house, four were left, how many were in the bag, write a number equation, have your mom or dad take a picture of it, send it to me on email, and you will get a shout out, hey, on episode two of On the Farm with Mr. T. So what else we got here? Um, that is pretty much our lesson for today this is our fun time for today i don't know what we're going to do with this we'll just keep trying it i want to connect with you i miss you i want to have fun amelia julie david ava skaya keep doing what you've been doing you're doing a great job keep it up uh i'm glad i heard from you i need to hear from the other people though mia mason r read some books tell me about what you're reading i know uh mia you were working on a chapter book weren't you connor and kaylin can you do the carrot math challenge it's a challenge i want to know Gavin, Elias, Skyler, uh, fill someone's bucket. Be kind and fill someone's bucket today and then tell me about it. Mason S., Maddie, and Drayden, help at home. Be a leader, be a model example, and take initiative. Ashton, Ryan, and Lila, work on some memory words. If you've got all your memory words, work on the bonus memory words. So that's the end of our On the Farm with Mr. T. Today was Sunday, March 22nd. You'll look for one of these each day. I'll send it to your mom and dad. I'm going to have it on my website. And we're going to get through this because we're going to connect with each other this way. If that's how we got to do it, we're going to do it. All right. I love you guys a lot. And um, send me those emails. I look forward to hearing from you and hearing what great stuff you're doing at home and how you're helping out your parents. All right. Love you. Bye.